It will be for North America and the continental United States the first total solar eclipse that they'll see from coast to coast since 1918. So we're talking 99 years since this happened before. Yes, so solar eclipses are incredibly rare. They only happen over particular locations on the Earth, and so that makes them very rare and a wonderful sight to behold. So a total solar eclipse, the moon completely covers the face of the sun and becomes very dark. You can actually see the brightest stars and planets in the sky, which is an incredible phenomenon to witness during the middle of the day. Unfortunately, here in Canada on the 21st, we won't experience a total eclipse of the sun, only partial. The total eclipse will be able to be seen across 14 states from the northwest down to the southeast. But still exciting enough here that there will be viewing parties across the country. It is in many cases a once in a lifetime event. It's something that everyone wants to partake in. But to view the eclipse safely, you need eye protection and sunglasses are not enough. You need high quality filters and not all of them are created equal. Once you have the filter on, you'll be able to look directly at the sun. And then your view will look something like this. But even though I just put that over my camera, that's not what that's for. You wouldn't use that over your cameras, binoculars, telescopes. No, you don't want to use these eclipse viewers over anything except your eyes. So you don't want to be observing the sun or the eclipse with binoculars, telescopes, anything that doesn't have a custom solar filter for protection. As for these filters that are meant for your eyes, make sure they are properly certified. So the current standard for these glasses are that they must be ISO and CE certified. You want to put them on before you look up at the sun and then look up and then look back down and then take them off. There are ways to observe the eclipse without looking directly at the sun. You can actually observe the shadows uh, on the ground caused by the eclipse using pinhole projection. But never look at the reflection of the sun off things like water or a mirror. That can be just as damaging as looking directly at the eclipse. Cause retinal burns at the back of our eyes, causing permanent eye damage. So that's true for any time that you look at the sun for any length of time. All of the do's and don'ts can be found on our website, citynews.ca slash extras. At the Ontario Science Centre, Audra Brown, City News.